Welcome back, YouTube audience. Welcome into the embassy. It is I, Ambassador Al, the Ambassador of Marvel Strike Force, and the Envoy of Winning. We win so much around here. Even when we lose, we still win. That's just how we roll. Make sure you hit that little like button and subscribe button and negotiate your way to becoming a diplomat with full rights and privileges there within. All right, let's get rolling. It's Blog Friday. Let me make the text a little bigger. You can see stuff. You want to see? You want to see stuff? Let's see stuff. <gasps> Zoggies! It's Zombie Juggernaut. I call him Mark Zuckerberg, but I have my own problems. I have my own problems. My own problems. Um, I'm so excited for this guy. You don't know. My voice gets so high. I'm so excited. All right. Um, mm, brains. Battle plan. Hey, Death Scourge. It's the it's the community manager Archangel Scourge. You can't. You cannot actually unlock Community Manager Ar uh, Archangel. Uh, you gotta. Get, you, there's only one. He is unique. <laughs> so unique. Uh, but you can get your own replica copy. Death Scourge. The Pegasus Team Showcase Finale. This is Monday. 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 That's the the finale ones. The one where like now you've got all the characters if you paid money or cored out for Ironheart, who's available right now. Um, uh, kids, check your parents' credit cards before you get to use them. Don't check the parents. Check the cards. Make sure that they're, they're not um, balance is full. Um, oh, check your parents, too. Get, your, get permission. Get permission. Anyway, um, it'll be the finale that involves you having to have, like, four stars or six stars to get all the extra cool stuff as detailed down below. Stuff to change. Uh, fight, fright or flight? We're going to blitz. Yeah! Blitzing is back, baby! A rice blitz. We blitz so much, we even eat blitz. Blitz is part of part of our it's part of our regular diet. Uh, USRDA uh, content is as little blitzing as possible. But um, hopefully, they can bring back the one hour blitz cooldowns at least for events. And I yes, I as an envoy have suggested that, and they said yes, we know you guys love the one hour cooldowns. Can you bring it back? Yes, we know you love the one hour cooldowns. Can you bring it back? Your feedback has been uh, reported. <laughs> so who knows? Who knows, guys? Stay tuned for that. Uh, Kestrel Blitz. In case you haven't got enough Kestrel from Milestones and Leaderboards and formerly the Premium Orbs, you're going to get Kestrel because Pegasus Team It's being featured and Kestrel's amazing and it's great. Uh, season 6 Battle Pass featuring Ghost Rider Robbie. Hey, is your Ghost Rider Robbie not quite 7 stars? Is it not quite 6 stars? Is it like 4 stars? Is it... Okay. Battle Pass is clearly the way of the future. Is the They know people aren't spending as much on the $100 offers for characters. And well played. Uh, not spending much on the $50 offers. $35, the $20, the $10, the ton. It's a touchdown! Um, so rather than belabor that point, they're saying, hey, what about we make Battle Passes and Strike Passes with not characters from a year ago, but ones from like three months ago, two months ago, recent kind of characters Will, will you give us 20 bucks then? Or so if you throw in some gold and some uh, Elite Sevens and some dark promos and some gear, Armor 18 orbs, they're like, done! So um, that's happening. And even a cool costume that I got forever ago, uh, but it's still great. The um, Werewolf at Night, Disney Plus, one, one episode feature thing was so cool. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm extra caffeine today, guys. So if you need to watch me on like 0.8 speed on YouTube, this is the one to go and slow down if that's what you need. And captions, I guess. You know, whatever. I'm, I'm, this is what I got. Uh, let's see. Wednesday, Strike Pass with Iron Man Infinity War. Same spiel as before. Another 20 bucks. It's a pass. They're trying to get you hooked on the idea of doing $20. Oh, it's only 20 bucks every two weeks and two different passes. So you're spending 80 bucks a month and getting decent stuff. But you got to... They, they, they want you to budget that and have it be, just be part of your normal thing. 80 bucks a month. That's what we do here. So get used to it. Get braced, commanders. Because um, it's a better it's a better deal than the other deals. But if you're free to play, then this is going to be in your face every day going, oh, I probably should buy this. No, I'm free to play. I'm free to play. They're, it's a business, guys. Uh, you know, you pick your lane. Stay there. Do you do you. Pick your own context. You'll be happy. Don't be pressured to be not you. Stay in school, kids. Don't do drugs. All right, uh, next Thursday, Werewolf Warzone. Another battle in war and earn ally supply to or fragments. Probably from donations, but I can't remember now. We'll see. And then, oh, spooky symbiotes. That's a quick rumble with symbiotes. Don't worry. You can get all the milestones and chill without having to go back and upgrade your symbiotes. So leave them alone. They're dead. They're dead. Um, keep an eye out for, I mean, who knows? Right. Here. Keep an eye out for Inbox Message that eventually Cosmo going to be in the 
Cosmo in the Cosmo Crucible store for Cosmo Crucible credits. A lot of C's. A lot of C's. A lot of C's. Um, yeah. Ironheart Mark II wasn't built in a cave. She was built in the mind of this really genius woman. Um, Juggernaut Zombie. We'll talk about the legendary in a moment. But yeah, it uh, apparently uh, identifies as male. <laughs> Big shock. It's a Marvel character. It's a 90% chance. Uh, Juggernaut Zombie. Woo! Zuckerberg! Mark Zuckerberg! Uh, what could be more terrifying than the unstoppable Juggernaut charging your way? Your credit card bill. No, um, how about an undead Juggernaut with a hunger for brains? That's right. The zombie endowed with the power of the Crimson Gem of Tarek is rushing toward the battlefield soon where he'll join Iron Man, zombie, and Hela on the Undying team. The previous Undying duo were a menace in Alliance War, and with Juggernaut Zombie by their side, this team is capable of dragging some of the top war teams to hell. Not a typo. That's the right spelling. As Guardian Hell is H E L. It's fun. Um, Jordan Zombie is a protector of scary resistance. You, you're gonna get them. You're gonna, you, you're probably gonna get them. The question is how many stars are you gonna get? But there's me event, right? They'll have limited time release, complete with an event, milestones, and offers. But once this whole feeding frenzy, this, uh, you know, Zambalaya, Zambalaya. Can I, can I copyright that? Trademark. All rights reserved. Um, hashtag. Uh, once this release period ends, you won't be able to earn or purchase these shards for an extended period of time. How long? An extended period of time is intentionally vague. Stop asking. Until they do. Uh, next week's blog will have a rundown of the actual event, actual milestones, and offers. But don't worry. Uh, in case you didn't know, Zombie Juggernaut was in this patch. He's in this patch. You already knew that. And the patch will end at some point because it's the last character not released in the patch. So, guess what? He's still on the way. It's like you're like tracking a package. It, your 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 dinner has left the restaurant, but it's not yet arriving. I know that. It's coming soon. Uh, Iron Man Zombie and Hell updates. Yeah, their kits will be updated to include you know, Zombie Juggernaut. Uh, but yes, also, have you thought about buying the pass? There's 80 in the in the in the premium pass. How many are on the free side? Not as many. All right. Oh, but it's still good, though. It's still good. I mean, it's better getting them. Free is better than not getting them at all. Uh, yeah, he's getting... Okay, they're, they're changing their kits to include jugger, Juggernaut. I mean, come on. Uh, Fright or Flight? Yeah. This is, a, this is a... Blitz! We'll do math videos later. Look, I love. I do like this. At the chart, first up, a new, different color. And the charts, if you want it, it's, it's you know, I put over... I open a new tab? Yeah, open a new tab. We'll look at the chart later. We'll do math later. There'll be a, whole, a different video, but we're going to blitz. We're going to blitz, dude. You're going to blitz because you want as much dark hawk as you possibly can. You want your, you want a big old dark hawk. Big dark hawks better than the smaller dark hawks from what I hear. That's, I'm just, I'm just, I know it's how well do you use your Pegasus team? How well do you use them? I know, but still, come on. Um, let's move on. Uh, she are Shriek Web Milestone. Yeah, they'll feed that. You're going to um uh, let's see. Earn Elias Crest. I can't remember if we're blitzing or... Oh, hold on. Well, quick look. Quick peek. Quick peek. We're earning Elias credits somehow. All right, whatever. It's fine. All right. Werewolf Warzone. Do your war attacks. So, hey, it's the event where you are incentivized to lose war attacks. Wait, so what your war alliance wants to do, if you don't know how, how it works, is hopefully you're winning your war anyway. But near the end, you find one team... And you go, hey, this guy's about to be the MVP of this war for his team. Oh, good time. And you, beat, you lose the same team over and over and over and over and over. It goes from 10 to 8 to 6 to 4 to 2 to 0. And then it stays at 0. You can lose 20 more times, and it'll still be at 0 points for when you eventually decide to go ahead and knock it out. So make sure those 10 points don't change your results or whatever, but you'll get more stuff. Did they cap this time? I think... Uh, hopefully they cap this time. I don't know. Last time there was, it was not a cap. Oh, the limit. But the limit is uh, 480, and there's two wars, and you have 24. Oh, maybe it's a real cap this time. It's a real cap. Holy crap, a real cap. Okay, I take it all back. Don't do this unless you have to. If you have to get those extra ones in, do the thing I talked about last time. But there's a there's a real cap. We don't have to lose. They learned from last time. They learned. They learned. It's like the really bad AI. It learns eventually. It learned. Oh my God. Yeah, Nick. I was like, <laughs> he was like, we're going to win anyway. Let's get 70 wins on 70 losses in the same place. Oh, 
I'm so glad it's got fixed. I, I should have I should have skimmed. I just didn't believe it. They actually fixed it. They fixed it. They fixed it, guys. It's better. It's you know, unless unless you only have unless your entire alliance doesn't um, isn't active in wars. If guys have fewer than ten attacks, you may find yourself if you're the you're the sweaty tryhard in the group doing a few extra attacks and losses to get up to the caps and stuff. But you, you know, you guys consider your context. We'll do a separate video on that stuff later on. But just remember, engineer it. If you have questions. Like and subscribe, or come and join us on Twitch, twitch.tv slash ambassadoral. We answer questions all the time. Usually 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Time, Monday through Friday. You know, we do what we can. All right. Friday Free Claim, Mark II. They got five of Ironheart. We're going to get that. Cool. And now for the fun news. You can have the next legendary. Oh, who's not actually being fully announced as to who the legendary is. Okay. But the trials are being more have more information. We're gonna get a legendary. You want the legendary, no matter what what it was. It could be a, be a, be a big flaming turd. And you're like, oh, legendary turd. Let's go. So we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Uh, you will need powerful squads of new Avengers and or rebirth. Don't worry. I'll explain what this means. If you're doing difficulty five through seven, so one through four, you don't have. It doesn't require either one. It's just you know, can you do it? Cool, cool, cool. Um, if it's difficult five through seven. On the critical nodes, you can use Aven new Avengers or Rebirth. You can mix and match. You can you can hybridize. You can put your you know, Tigra and Ronan and, and Mockingbird along with Captain America and Captain Carter and have a good time. On difficulty eight and above, one of those nodes is going to require new Avengers, and just new Avengers, and one of those is going to require Rebirth, and like just Rebirth. So if you're trying difficulty eight and higher. You're going to have to build both teams. But if you're definitely eight or higher, you probably already did build both teams. So it's not a huge deal. Comment down below whether this is like a deal breaker for you or like, eh. Comment down below. We need to know. We want to know. Because they're trying to figure out like what kind of team should we pick for the secondary team. We know the main team is going to be a really new team that didn't sell enough at first. Um, and the second team will be not as good. But how not as good do they need to be? to make people not mad that they're building them. We kind of said, hey, a raid team that lasts for a few months is okay, right? At least, but the question is like, yeah, but like a year from now, this team will probably suck. I'm like, yeah, but in the past we had to build like, you, you, people were trying to build like Dark Hunters or Sinister Six or what, or Ravagers or some crap. So these are, this is a better team for most people's rosters than those other teams, but is it the, the best? Is it the most player friendly? I mean, it could be a hell of a lot worse, but comment down below. What do you want? You want to be like, it should be the newest raid team, or would you be like, oh, no, I don't want to build Pegasus. That, 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 it's, it'll take too long, or I don't want to build a team that's too old. I want to build I want to build Web Warriors again? Like, what do you guys, what, what would you think, is the, what's the happy medium between you guys and the and the game devs, where they want to, they want to build things that are fairly new, right? I don't know. This is going to be controversial, and we'll talk about this for weeks. All right. Uh, First run has more rewards. We know that. There's a leaderboard, more stuff. We'll have more information on Lex Legendary and his. <gasps> it's not a female character or a, or a non-binary character. It's a male-identified male character. Okay, but who is it? I can't tell you. Okay, cool. Um, and his entire team. He's getting a team. He's going to be on a team. It's not, so it's not a standalone Legendary. He's going to have a team. And that team's going to have kits and stuff. Are they, all, are they all new characters? Are there any reworks? Is it a mix of the two? I don't know. I actually don't. I'm sure some super envoys do, but I'd, I'm just a lowly, I'm just a regular old envoy. I'm like a whale, not a kraken of the, of, of the, the content creator world. I'm in there, but I'm not like all up in there. So uh, we'll see. We'll see. In the meantime, keep working new Avengers. Rebirth, you should probably be working anyway. I have recommended for DD6. That's not a bad investment. All things, all things considered. But again, comment down below. What's the date? Uh, no date. What's legendary? No legendary. But there's going to be a kits. Uh, is it next week's blog? Yeah, maybe it, it might be next week's blog, but it might be two weeks, two blogs out. I don't know. It's upcoming. There'll be kits. There'll be more details. More details to come. Let the fire. Let, let the fuel. For, let the speculation begin. Let the let's fuel for the fire. But we don't have the actual you know substance yet. But, but at least you know what to build now. You should build new Avengers and probably rebirth if you're doing higher difficulties. Or a mix of the two if you're doing difficulty five through seven, which I think is good news. You can do a hybrid. 
just be good. All right, uh, Patrick Pegasus. Yeah, the showcase finale event. Yeah, that's, that's the last one where it's like, hey, guess what? You're going to need all the characters at gear 15, no matter what. But gear 15 is not that bad for most end game players. It's going to be the stars, you'll see. If you're doing the challenge one, you can get gear 15, no problem. There are 3 million blue ISO 4 ions up for grabs, 4 gear tier 16 mini uniques. It's great, along with additional gear tier 6. Great, cool, cool, cool. Alright, that's not super exciting for some people I talk to. Alright, here's where most of us are going to be. Legend, wait, wait for it, wait for it. Legend, oh, sorry, sorry. It'll be Legend, wait for it. Dairy, Legend Dairy. Thanks, Barney. How about your mother? Um, you'll need an elite squad with each of the five characters of gear 15 and four yellow stars. Uh-oh. Uh, you'll get two million blue ISO 5 ions and 320 gear tier 17 mini uniques available if you complete all the nodes and do first time rewards. And you can also keep farming and stuff. You know, it's cool. Nice. Bonus, a.k.a. Kraken Treats. Welcome to the green room. Um, welcome to the VIP lounge. And uh, I don't know what you heard about the champagne room, but it is actually, uh, everything's available in the champagne room. Um, for the cream of the commander crop, ugh, uh, the bonus difficulty calls upon Pegasus characters at gear 15 and six yellow stars. Who's going to have their Ironheart Mark II at six stars that fast? I, so it's going to run for a while, but who's going to give them six stars? All but six, okay. But if you do, if you do, two million blue ISO five, uh, same as up here. Yeah, and the 2 million blue ISO 4. Oh, cool, and 220 gear tier 18 mini uniques. And also gear 17 stuff, you know. Cool, 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 cool. Who? that's a bonanza. Is, is this juice worth the squeeze of getting six yellow stars in your characters? I don't know. This is mostly, in my mind, aimed at the people who are already going to have them at six stars anyway. And hey, welcome back, spenders. Here's some more treats for you. Or if you're on the fence, if this was the month where you're thinking, hey, I'm going to cut back and only get five stars on my my Pegasus characters, this is, they're saying, no, you're going to want to get six. Oh, fine. More perks, more treats. That's a thing. Don't get mad. My, I tell you, I always tell you guys, find your lane, be happy, set your goals, and you'll be happy with your life. I don't want your life. James Vanderbeek, Varsity Blues. That's only like a billion years old. Anyway, um, you got to do you. Gotta do you. Uh, I think Striker for Ironheart. All right, um, <laughs> but we'll see. You know, don't be mad. I think just build what you want to do. I'm going to be building for here. I'm aiming for legendary. I mean, I got super scroll. I was 141 for super scroll. I have a 60 million TCP almost. I'm 58. I'm getting there. I'm not going for this. That's to me. That's for my budget. That's too crazy. I'll give them a six stars eventually. But this is a pretty nice, pretty nice surprise. But it, don't be all fomoed out. Unless that's if it's your jam, it's your jam. I get it. I'm not going to hold against you. But just you know, be you. We don't spend our shame. We don't free-to-play free to shame. You spend what you spend. You do what you do. Hey, you have fun. Have fun, dude. <laughs> I'm not touching that one in the mill. All right. So uh, we'll come back to how crazy it is. We'll see. Strike by season 45. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be a little longer. I've said that before. Um, it'll be 19 days instead of 14 days to make the patch run out and the thing, the timing and stuff, right? You'll find more rewards remaining after season 45 being adjustment to levels, including this pass. Guess what? There are going to be separate passes. So the intermediate pass will be 50 to 79, and the advanced pass will be 80 and above. I don't even know what it is right now. I don't know. I should, I should have done my homework on that. But two passes, and the it'll deliver more relevant rewards to players that can use them. So more gear tier 15 stuff for those who are 50 to 79, and more gear tier 17 stuff for up here. You know, you both have gold, whatever. More silver promos there, more gold promos there. We'll look at it when it comes around. But I think it's a good idea. I like the idea. But that comes on the 25th. The Fizif. All right. Battle Pass. Season 5. Oh, there's more. <sighs> Ghost Rider Robbie. And the costume. Two treats. Costume. And more dark promo credits because we need them. Because, we you know, they want us to all have separate stars and everything because something else is coming. I don't know what it is. I mean, I've seen some rough drafts. I've seen lots of speculation videos. There's something else clearly coming down the, down the line. When? I don't know. What? I don't know. Will it be amazing? It better be. Will it be, better be affordable? That's what we're fighting over. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? But in the meantime, they're throwing red stars at you. Go get them. 
Just don't don't spend your money. We want to earn your winning more than spending to win. But you know, you know how this game works. We do a bit of both. We do a bit of both. We do a bit. Ah, uh, golden dimension reminder. Yeah, don't forget. Don't forget spend gold to get a this crazy costume. Uh, if you're spending gold, great. If you got things to spend on, great. Don't spend extra gold to chase a costume. Now, if you're a because honestly, in order to get to get a substantial amount enough points to get there, I think we found is basically you just spend like, like a bare minimum of like 12 million gold per day to have a chance at this, which is 360 million gold. And I'm pretty sure that won't be enough. That's I said, it's more probably more like 14 million gold per day to get the get the costume stuff, which is like 420 million gold over. If that ain't you, it ain't you. Stop, stop. Save your gold, earn, make it useful, do the things you got to do. I will do what I want to do, stay winning. <laughs> so that's really it, guys. Juggernaut's coming eventually. The tri legendary, it's coming. Rebirth, okay. Better passes, great. Ironheart's already available, great. Pegasus stuff's already in game to go look at. It's great. Let's go get it, guys. I think the game's in a good place. I'm curious where it's going to head with the next legendary. And I'm curious what's going to happen for the... Where's our roadmap ahead? Where's our second half of the year roadmap? Where's our what's coming next? What's the what's the big bad? Uh, we need what's the hey? How have we done since the six months ago, first half of the year? How have we done? What are we gonna catch up on? What do we apologize for? What do we pat ourselves on the back for? Where is that? Uh, I'm not the only person asking for that. I just want to say where is it? Where that? Um, hopefully, hopefully next week we get that. I, I just gotta be in there. Uh, it's gotta be, it's gotta be coming sometime soon, right? Cause they, we, they've always done one, I think. Right. And we definitely need one. I think people need a, a, a pick me up of like, what's the next thing before we get too far gone. Cause super scroll excitement is kind of fading. People are still doing it and they should, it's great. But the, we, we all know what we're doing. We all, we as humans, we want to know what the next now is great. The next is always better. And in fact, the next, next always better. So that's how we roll. That's how we live. We demand more future information we like to speculate we want to plan ahead we like to plan okay that's how it goes anyway until next time enjoy your weekend touch grass bring your mobile device with you and have some fun and remember you can win at not just the game winning at life winning beats losing losing beats not playing as long as you're in the game you can win the fight another night keep on playing and stay winning love you guys Bye bye